Lot 41, Spot Barrow 39-2. Uh, this is a mattress pad crossover, supposedly. Yeah, a little different pedigree here on the bottom side. Uh, out of the 13.9 saddle we picked up from Andy Rash there a couple of years ago that had a successful show career. Uh, you get into the 39.2 here, and uh, I think this one's got a pretty high ceiling. Um, you know, I, I admire this pig for his... Uh, uh, his boldness that you get here um, in his rib and, and uh, out of his blade. Uh, he's big about his arm. He's big about his rear leg. Um, and then you put him in motion. And, and uh, the length of front that, that we get out of this pig, I think, uh, um, is is second to none. Um, you know, I like his maturity. He's He reads with uh, enough immaturity to, to go to some higher weights and to, to um, you know, to be able to feed on and uh, – I think this pig here um, has got gotten a lot of quality and, and uh, one that we're pretty high on. Yeah, this uh, cool colored bear here, uh, I'm a big fan of his color pattern. Uh, I'm a big fan of his bone work, too. I think that's a stout critter uh, that's got a wild neck on him that uh, comes high out of the top side of his blade. Stout about his skull. He comes directly at you. Very good in his chest floor. What's really impressive about this bear is when you get right on top of him, uh, not only is he big and dimensional in his upper skeleton, uh, but he feeds so true uh, into the base uh, of his mid-body and, and the roll and turn uh, to his cage is very, very acceptable. That that type right there reads like a uh, feeding kind that, that's got a big window uh, that uh, is going to have a lot of success later on down the road. Uh, certainly one uh, that's just so complete everywhere. Uh, and at this stage of the game, I love where he's at from a maturity standpoint. 